Members of a Pennsylvania church are in shock this morning after a minister was arrested on murder charges. He is accused of killing his second wife, and now there are questions about how his first wife died. And our Andrew Canning is here with more on that surprising to say the least. Good morning, Ram. This is really a bizarre story. Police say secrets from Arthur Shermer's past are catching up to him and the news comes as a shock to members of his old congregation. He was a respected pastor for decades, even serving the Pennsylvania State House. Now he's heading to court today to face a murder charge. Pastor Arthur Shermer's first wife, Jewel, fell to her death down a flight of stairs in 1999. Nearly a decade later, his second wife, Betty Jean, was killed in a car crash. Both were ruled accidents. He appeared to be the unlucky widower, but some members of his congregation suspected more. My parents adored him and every, all the older people in here, but I knew there was something strange about him. Police have now charged Shermer with murder. They say newly uncovered evidence proves he killed Betty Jean and used the crash as a cover-up that the car was going just 20 miles an hour, a speed too slow for her extensive injuries, and traces of her blood were found inside the church. Shermer explained it by telling police a wood pile had fallen on her. We anticipated that they were investigating and we'd have to face these accusations and we're fully prepared to do so. Those findings prompted police to reopen the death of Shermer's first wife, Jewel, seen in this video. A vacuum cord was found wrapped around her leg, but an autopsy concluded her injuries weren't consistent with a fall. We're going to conduct a, a brand new investigation. An investigation into another bizarre incident at the church also yielded new suspicions about how the women died. After one of Shermer's congregation members committed suicide in the pastor's office, police say they discovered through intimate emails that Shermer was having an affair with the man's wife. It's really shocking. I never thought this could happen in this area and, and precisely someone that is from the church. Arthur Shermer's attorney says his client denies foul play was involved in the deaths and his daughter by his first wife says she's standing by him. Shermer's alleged former mistress also wrote an email to the Associated Press saying, I love A.B. with all my heart and I support him 100 percent. So people, to it, yeah. people standing by him throughout all this. They are. All right, Andrew, thank you very much.